So back here now for the replay of the County Under-21 football final between Arfinan and Truman, our Upper Church Tramban here in Butterland. For two of the teams, Arfin Maroon and White, in goals, Cahill Boyle, Dara Boyle, Sean Nagel, Robert Condon. At back line, Shane Keaton, Colin Shocknessy, Michael Tobin. Centre field, Ger- Jerry Cronin, Stephen Lambert, captain. Half forward line, Gavin Whelan, Aaron Lonergan, Colin O'Gorman. Full forward line, Michael Barlow, Michael Hogan, Colin Doyle. Subs, Mark Kelly, Alan Condon, James Shine, Darren Slattery, Brian Butler, Daniel Cunningham, and Evan Barris. And the re- through the just getting ready for the throwing with the referee Paddy Russell and he throws it in and the game is on Jerry Crone breaks it down towards Aero Lonergan Aero has it you see down now towards Colin Doyle Colin going to take on his man nice ready to run and a look at his options he's had to go back to Colin O'Shocknessy Jerry Cronin has it now he's looking what he do with it gives it out to Captain Stephen Lambert Stephen now should leave it in towards Michael Hogan. Michael Hogan won that well. He's gone around to him in. He got the advantage. And the ball has gone wide. First wide of the game, so. I thought the referee might give the pull it back there for a free in, but obviously not. Uh, Judge Coley, PJ Buck kicks it out here now towards this one now. Michael Barla has it. Michael gives it on to Shocks. Shocks takes on his man. The, the corner flag out now to Michael Barla. Michael has scored 1 4 the last day. He's out to take 92 men. He looks like to be fouled. The ref could have left that off. He kicked it over the bear, but the referee now has pulled it back. So. I don't, know, I don't know why he couldn't have left the score stand. But it's the open, open a minute or two after have been on the ball a lot. So hopefully now Michael can steady himself and get the score sheet up and running. Yes, and that's first score of the game. Arfin one point. Up to Trump, Trump band, no score. Topper Trust Drum Band Team, PJ Burke, Nathan Delaney, Toby Clancy, Ronan Gleason, Dean Carew, TJ Butler, Lockton Ryan, Joe Grant, Captain and Gavin Ryan, Paul Shanahan, Jack Butler and Robert Murphy, Tara Brennan, Dylan Sheridan, Niall Grant, Peggy Burke, John Ryan, Jason Jordan, Brian Sheridan, Connor Ryan. So PJ Burke with the kick out. Head down the middle and it's one there, a great win by Paul Shanahan. Paul would a very good very good game in the strong game now this shocks now pulled back pulled him back there and he could be definitely a yellow card whether whether he could give it it's a yellow card yeah for calling a shock in the seat Paul Shannon now has the ball in his hand. So he scored again 1 4 1 5 in the drawing game. So he's his first, first attempt for Hopper Trust from Ben and straight over the black spot. The teams are level. One point apiece. Now the way this is started is the makings of another very good entertaining game, like the drawing game, one goal and ten points each. Cahill Boyle now kicks it out this way towards Jerry Cohen. Jerry goes up and Jerry wins it clean, but it's broken by Joe Grant has it. So he's looking out for Jack Butler. Jack Butler gives it down now to Dara Brennan. Been tasseled by Robert Condon and well run by Con- Robert. And Robert still has it, and he's at the, in the ball out the, over the line. It's a line ball now to Upper Church. And we take now with TJ Butler. PJ Butler gives it in now, straight in. Jack Butler gets it, and it's gone wide. So 
we would one point each still. Call now to kick out. Shocks is calling for the out this way and Colin Cahill kicks it out towards him and it's up. Looks like it puts in the back. Shocks not. Oh. It's on now Gavin Whelan. Now. Gavin gives it to Robert Condon. On to Smiley. Smiley hops his all gets, gets it out of trouble, gives it on out to Gavin Whelan. Gavin has it now. And that's the ball. He kicks it straight in now towards Michael Barlow. Michael, the ball is after coming loose. It's been collected there by John Ryan. John Ryan now has it. And good pressure by. And it's a free in to Arfinan, yeah. Good pressure there by Arfinan and uh, John Ryan of Orkle Church. And he fouled the ball. So it's going to be a free in to Arfinan. See with the left legged player, Michael Rose. Michael Barlow has it. Michael is down, he's for, looking for attention. Like his wrist or something, he's holding. It's, it's a good brisk day here now. Good dry, good ideal condition for football. There's no no wind or nothing. <coughs> Michael's after being treated there by the physio Paula Cairns and this is, this is a tricky old kick now by Michael now it's dropping short into PJ Box hands. He gives it out now to John Ryan. John Ryan gives it out and the PJ the goal is the travelling on a bit. Gives it out to Joe Grant. After walking it out now towards George still have it now. The pressure now by Michael Barlow. Him, good pressure, keep him there, Michael. Here or now, John Ryan has it. Gives it back now to TJ Butler. So right now, Dobber Church captain gives it out now to Toby Clancy. He's coming up the line. Colin O'Gorman is chasing him. And good pressure, he, he got rid of it there. Gives it out to Jack Butler. Hope George still at that. They're traveling a long way with the ball now. Number seven is locked and right. He's been chased there by Colin Dial. He's having a pop. It's a weak effort and it's gone wide. It's good build up play there by Hubbard Church. So Colin Dial now with the kick out again. Was the other wing this time now towards Dara Bay, but it's one now by Niall Grant. Niall Grant, he receives it back. Good pressure, good pressure, and Mike Tobin got it. And Mike Tobin was fouled there. So now Sean, o Sean Nagel is going to take it. <coughs> He's looking at it options. No one making a move for him, and he has to go straight across to Stephen Lambert. He gives it on now to Smiley. This is gives it on now to Jerry Cohen. Jerry been pressurized by Paul Shannon. He's after losing it. Get, runs on to Smiley. Smiley lost it. This Jerry Cohen is after winning it back. Gives it out now towards Colin Dyle. Colin Dyle holds it. Gives it on now to Mike Hogan. Mike Hogan takes on his man. And he's still gone round him. And it's a line ball. It's always oh, the signal and line ball to our Finnan. Is it on now? Mike Hogan on to Colin Doyle. And Colin kicks it. And it's gone out of there. Good score by Colin Doyle. Good pass there by Mike Hogan. So good score by Colin Doyle. Colin, Colin scored a point in the replay game as well. So now our Finnan lead two points to one. 
PJ Buck now with the kick out. Straight down the middle towards Aero. Aero breaks it. Anyone? No. Guinness John Ryan has it. Overtouch oh, after breaking now the full back full back is giving it in towards full power didn't show it in. And he gives it back. John John Eagle meets him at the solar. Giving out to the full forward. Full forward gives it in. Kicks an up and round towards Dara Boyle and Niall, Niall Grant. And Dara Boyle, yep, Dara Boyle's at the win there and there's two more from him. Dara has the kick, free kick. He gives it straight out to Robert Condon. Robert took his eye off it there for a minute. And watch it inside, lads. You know, down from the last day, he, he overdone it at times. Gives it out now to Shocks. Shocks is... How many is he going to take on? And he's still gone past, he's left, left four or five in his wake. He's pressurised by Joe Grant. The shock still has it. And he kicks it out towards the corner, out towards Colin Dyer. Colin has it now. Well, and he's still, the two men, he's in to be wrestled and the free in Carfinan. On the right hand side and this could suit Colin now. He's leaving it now for Jerry Cronin. <laughs> Jerry has scored a couple of points in the the drawing game. So Jerry steadies himself now. It's on the 14 yard line, but is over near the sideline. Jerry calls, calls, gone wide. Can't afford to. Uh, chances there, like, that was a chance. If an angle, but. PJ Buck now with the kick out. There's options. Going out the right wing now, down towards and calling a shot and St. Paul Shannon. Two. County under 21 Tipperary teammates. Now, so far, didn't share and Sean Nagel, Sean shoulders them. Sean, go down the ball, Sean. Got to win the line ball, line ball to Arfin, and Sean goes back to Dara Boyle. Dara gives it out to Shocks. Shocks on to Mike Tobin. Mike Tobin on to Jerry Cronin. A lot of passes were after getting about 20 yards. Jerry Cronin now, big long stride, and that's the one. Pump it in. But Colin Lyle was behind his man. But he's good pressure, you have to recover on well, keep him there. You have to be, forwards have to be out in front. So, upper touch are working it out again now. Upper touch man is well pursued there by Colin O'Gorham. Colin done well to Robin. Win it back now, Shocks has it. Shocks is on the ball a lot today. It's a free in now to, I think that one are still doing a bit of over, over holding on to the ball. Shannon now gives it out now to Niles Grant. Niles Grant is out there, giving two lads in his wake. Back to Paul Shannon. He's, up, he's gone around his man and he kicks it. He should drop into Cottle's arms. Hands up. Cottle gives it out now to Mike Tobin. Mike Tobin. A bit loose. Is it on to Robert Condon and just line ball to Upper Church. Simple things are just. Oh, the ball, line ball went to our fin and then, oh my god, they're out to kick it. Giving it away. Upper Church now on that. Number nine is out traveling long ways. Gives it out now towards Paul Shannon. His left leg. Now, He's usually fairly accurate then, yeah. I've been there two or three attempts there to get rid of that ball, I don't know. This is Paul's second point of the game. I've been in two points, of just from Ben, two points. Cahill now, kick out now. Seems to down, down the middle towards Conn Gong. Conn held on to it. 
but it's been nothing now. Upper George Habit out towards the gentleman Paul Shannon. He kicks it in. Keep him there, Dara. Keep him out. Dara done well to because he's at conceding the free. The free into Upper Church and yeah. No surprise, Paul Shannon has the ball in his hands. He's looking he's looking for his options. Simple ball in and he's going to receive it again. Yeah. No one is no one is awake to this. Gives it on now, dropping it in towards it's gone wide. Oh, look to have it covered. Definitely now, the last few minutes, it's been all up or touch. But the score is still two points apiece. Coming out this wing, yeah, coming out towards air on Gavin Whelan. Just hits out the break and loose on Gavin Whelan now. Gavin should get on, on. Uh, get onto it, and he gives it on now to Aero Lundigan. Like Aero's after making a good run into space, and Michael, ah, that after fall, no reach of that. It's basic under six hours now, two lads um, playing senior football. He should know better than that. Now, Upper Church on the attack again. It. Pressurized by Rob Condon and Gavin Whelan. Full forward has it now. Sean Nagel's with him. Upper Church on the attack. Joe Grant and he's after breaking through to him. Yeah. Ridiculous, I don't know. Ridiculous foul in it. In a scoring opportunities, especially in the form that Paul Shannon is. Ridiculous. The Noel Payton fouled him within 45 yards ago because this man is fairly deadly. As he proved the last day, why didn't we learn? But that all came from two of our players going for the same ball. No call, nothing. No, look at that. No. Up a church three points, half in and two points. Three upper church points have come from Paul Shannon. Stephen Lambert now is after receiving the kick out. He gives it on now to Sean Nagel. Sean gives it on to Colin O'Gorman. Colin drives it in now, going towards Colin Dyle. Colin has it. He looked to pull Gerald Ger Ger there. He's out touching the ball on the ground, so it's a free in Tarfinan. They're 30 yards out. It's an opportunity for Michael Barlow now. Michael Barlow has it. And there's no one inside if it drops short like like the last kick dropped short, so Michael now. That is And there's two scoreable frees after and after missing. Peaky Buck now kicks down the middle towards Jerry Cronin. Three of them, three for the centre forward who He's out for all kickouts. This is a strong one. He's after leaving two lads in his wake. They are for Alfinan. Again, another foul for Alfinan. They're just, the discipline at the moment now is just 
very poor. And he's playing into upper torch hands. If you handy freeze, tip it over the bear. Centre back now, TJ Butler. Right hand side, kicks it. Yeah, more the bear. So now, up to Trump Ben are leading now four points to two. Now coming out this way now towards Jerry Cronin again the centre forward is there when Tara Boyle has it. And after clicking the loose ball, Shocks has it now. Shocks kicks just across now to Jerry Cronin. Tara Boyle. Will you leave it in? Tara's out taking on two or three men and he's out kicking it in. Sean Nagel's after winning that well. It's a good one now, Sean. Giving it out now to Jerry Cronin. Jerry Cronin now is having a look up. Kicks it in now towards Colin Dial. Colin Dial's after winning it. He's in the corner, will you? Giving it out now to Gavin Whelan. Gavin Whelan now in pursuit by two, two overtouch. Jersey pulled for if he didn't see a man. Gavin is after making some ground. And if he fits that all, that's an absolute great score by Gavin Whelan. That's what you need. Good determined running there. He got it out in the corner flag. And he bit two or three of them. He walked his way in. So it's now back to a one point game. Upper touch from down four points. Our Finn three points. So it has to win. They leave the ball in. We're causing problems in there. PJ Buck now with the kick out. Out this wing. And he's all alone, Joe Grant. An easy one for him. Touch now. And towards now ground. Well run by Robert Condon. Gap. It's come to Jerry Cronin. Jerry gives it on now to Colin O'Gorman. Colin kicks it in. Oh. Norman now is, yeah, deserves, and rightly so, deserves going to the book for that. Another needless, pointless, and ridiculous foul. Yeah, yellow card. Going to come back to Paul Shannon, yeah. No one was alive to that. And, uh, Paul Shannon gives it out now to number seven, has it. And he's going to give it back to Paul Shannon. <laughs> Full forward now, has it for Upper Church. They're holding possession. Kicking it back now to the middle of the field. Oh. It's just... Look at number 13 on his own. Because he didn't spot him just as well and he kicks it wide. So it remains up to from Ben four points, at uh, Finn three points.
Oh, the the kicks in now. Come on, come on, get rid. Come on. Uh, Direct name, Robert Condon has it. Robert now gives out Sean Nagel. Sean Nagel onto Mike Tobin. Mike Tobin onto Smiley Keaton. Smiley makes a run now. Leave it off. Gives it on out to Gavin Whelan. Gavin kicks it in now. It's a lot of work, a lot of work now for that. PJ Burke with the kick out again for Upper Church. Set up and under up towards Stephen Lumber and Colin O'Gorman and Colin Shocks has it and does two of them holding him. And uh, is he going to bring it forward? Jerry. Jerry Cohen now. And this free kick now is going to take it off his, off the ground. It doesn't have any man down injured first. Looks like Colin Agam is down. So we came up here expecting a good, tough, close game again. And so far now that's what it is. Not in between these teams. I think I've missed some scoreable freeze and this is another fairly scoreable freeze so we'll deal with this one now. So Jerry has it now. He stands now. Kicks, kicks, kicks. And it's yes, it's very good. Big kick by Jerry Cronin. Jerry's first point of the game. It's now a strong game again. Hart Finnan, four points. Upper Church, Upper Church from Ben, four points. Upper Church goal, you know. PJ Buck with the kick out. This is big up and under, up towards Colin O'Gorman again. Breaks now. Stephen Lambert first to, to react, and he gives it on now to Aero. Aero now gives in. Colin O'Gorman has a bit of space now. This Chance now, ah, got blocked. So the break, and will Mike, Ho Mike Hogan has it. Mike Hogan. Colin Dial has it. No, that. It's resulted in a free out, but there was a chance there for Affin to get it. Score now. Now touch the pitcher's run down on the in possession. Gavin Whelan with him. Ah. Free, free out to uh, Upper Church. Um, kicks it in and it's at Dara Boyle got the break gives it on to Sean Nagel on to Colin O'Gorm Colin O'Gorm kicks it right in towards Michael Barrow Michael Barrow now turns back onto his trusted left foot it's gone wide again PJ Bork now with the kick out again. Okay, now watch the break, Dosh in, up with shocks and Stephen Lambert again is first to react to this break. He gives it on down to Mike Tobin. Mike Tobin. Through the free, yeah. Okay. Take on Tobin. Drive it in, shot! Drive it in! Drops it in now towards Michael Bell. Again, they're giving them a lot of work to do. And there seem to be two men over to cover Michael. Yeah. 
good recovery and Michael's after winning that now and he gives it on and gives it away Noble Church quick break now it's down down the right break here he over carries it but they still have possession and done Robert Care now to midfielder Jerry Grant and there's a good one by the wing forward and he's after getting it and he's gone a long way which has to be a great save but he <laughs> ever fouled him like quite they're just handing this petty foul and it only hand in scores to Albert Church. Hodgson and three points of air in this. Could be an easy kick, kick for them, yeah. yeah. Again, Albert Church going the lead. Five points to four. Again, for needless fouling. They're getting three or four of their scores now from ridiculous freeze. Cahill Boyle. Kicks it down towards Jerry Cohn. Jerry Cohn, yeah, that's great feeling by Jerry. Again, he'd been smothered by two or three of them. Stephen Lambert, Stephen Lambert. Goodbye now, Aero has a lot of room in front of him. And he looks up and he kicks it in towards Michael Barlow. Michael Barlow has it. Hit it over the bear. Out towards Mike Tobin, Mike Hogan, and Mike Hogan kicks it over the bar. It's Mike's first score of the game, and it's after Brenda Tien's level again, five points apiece, coming up towards half time. And um, that came from good ball left in by Aero. That's the way to do it, leave it in. And the inside forward line will get the scores. So PJ Buck now with the kick out. And there's the half-time whistle. Again, no surprise, that, no surprise that the teams are level at half-time. There's nothing to separate these teams. So it's uh, Finn and five points, Upper Trust Drum Band, five points. So now, back up and ready now for the second half of this replay, County 121B football final now, Finn and Five points, upper trust from Ben, five points. Don't oh, see to be any changes now in any of the, any of the lineups. Stephen Lambert now. Out to be fouled there. It gives it back now to Shocks. Shocks on to Conor Gorman. Have a look up, Conor. Out to be giving it out now to Mike Torben. Mike Tobin back to Jerry Cronin. Oh, Jerry Cronin, big high ball. And, uh, that's well held there by. An open church break with it now, and they kick it out this way out towards the full forward, being tackled by Sean Nagel. Pull the forward wins it, getting out towards the sideline. Gives it on now to corner forward. And Jerry, ah, oh, well won by Gavin Whelan. Now it's set up another half in attack. Gavin is travelling with it. Gives it on now to Ka <laughs> Up to John Deere tries to cap on the attack now. It's captain pressurised by Mike Torben. Now Gavin Whelan is with him. He's going to chance to one from distance. And Cottle Boyle is watching it. Watching it and the umpire signal has just gone wide. As he looks at, his, looks at his options, kicks, he going straight down the middle. Dara by it, oh, well held Dara. Gives it on to Shocks. Shocks gives it out to Aero. Nero turns back, 
gives it on now to Colin O'Gorman. It's open up now in front of it. Colin now has gone inside the 45 yards out. He's having a look. He gives it back to Jerry. Jerry Cohen. Jerry takes on his man. Gives it out to Captain Stephen Lamb. Stephen looks to be pulled. He's out to Mike Barlow. Again, there's four or five of them around him. Are finding it hard to get a, try and get a kick in. And Jerry just uh, kicking over, and that's a very good score. Very good score, and are finna lead now. Jerry's second point of the game. It's now six points to five in front of favour of Arfin, but uh, the pressure the up touch backs put on the Arfin as they didn't know. But it came to Jerry Cohen anyway, and Jerry's out uh, getting the lead score for Arfin. I know it's Colin O'Gorman. And Colin wins it again. And he's gone, he's having a look. And he's dropping it in, in towards Mike Tobin. And Mike Hogan. Oh, that was. Albert Trump coming down the line, being pressurized by Gavin Wheeler. And he's gone. Now, Colin, get. Come on, Colin, get up. Looks like our Finn haven't learned from their first half mistakes. They're giving away petty frees. And so Paul Shannon again. Paul Shannon has it now. Paul Shannon now being pressured by our Finn captain. Left leg, lads, left leg. Mike Barlow back there now. Keep him going out, lads. Number 17, John Ryan has it. He's out to come the long way. And fits it on full forward. Well blocked, Dara Boyle. Well done. Ah, that was a high tackle. Well done, Dara. Great, great blocking. And he gets it out now to Colin O'Gorman. Colin O'Gorman. Nice ball on towards Mike Mike Hogan. Mike, Ho Mike Tobin. Mike Hogan has it. Mike kicks it in this way. And it's broken down and up touch on the attack. And the cornerback is up a long way. He faces shots. Back with Joe Grant, the uh, upper torch captain. He gives it on now towards Mike Paul Shannon. Paul Shannon now. He's out of cutting in. He's cutting in rather easily. Oh, and his side netting. Referee in the office having a word with the upper church. Full forward who gets a yellow card for that earlier high tackle on Dara Boyle, who did brilliantly to block that attack and set up an Arfin attack which came to nothing but Cottle Boyle now. Straight down the middle, down towards in Jerry Cohn as in Shocks was watching the break, he looked to the jersey, was pulled. Butler now for Upper Church. And now to Jack. Again, our Finn has given, given a free. Have they learned at all? Upper Church scored five points to the first half, and four of them came from frees. Upper Church now. Big ball is dropping in, it's dropping in, it's dropping in. And <laughs> up the force now, Colin O'Gorman has it. He gives it on now. Down to 21 on to Gavin Whelan. He's looking at what's in front of him. He kicks it on here now towards Mike, Mike Torben. Mike Hogan. So we've got three mics now, we're getting on rightly, rightly confused. And that's a that's an awful ball for anyone to try and win. And with the first sub the game, number 12, Robert Murphy, Robert Murphy is coming on. Hello for Tristram Ban. He's going to wing forward now. And now it is number 19 is coming out, Brian Sheridan. So, 
Only Peter Buck now kicks it out, kicks it out this wing now towards Colin O'Shockham's team. Colin. Again, this Jack Butler has seen a lot of the ball again today. He's hard the last day as well. He's out for every kick out. Up church on the attack now. Yep. They're walking, walking in and well done, Sean Nagel and Robert Smiley broke up that attack. Tanner Bile gives it on to Gavin Whelan. Gavin Whelan now on to Aero. Aero, a lot of grass in front of him. And he plays across towards Mike Hogan. Mike Hogan with two lads around him. Gives it on to Colin O'Gorman. Colin is trying to kick, kick, kick. He's gone wide. Kick out by the goal and he's had to go straight to Michael Bell. And Michael is running now. He's cutting in on his left hand side. Just trade him around him. He's still going through, and that's surely a free. But not over carrying it. An upper touch now set up another attack. Down the right wing, Colin O'Gorman. Yeah, another free. In towards Paul Shannon. Man. Now it's uh, to break into Colin Dyle. Colin Dyle gets it up, gives it out now to Gavin Whelan. Gavin Whelan then. Jeez, trying to walk into trouble. And he gets away. You have enough. Get it rid of it, Gavin. That's it, in towards, now, over the bell. Ah, oh, brilliant, brilliant, on his right leg this time. But Gavin Whelan, I thought he was taking on too many, but he knew what he was at. Give it in to Mike Bell, oh, Mike on his right leg this time. Kicks it over the bell, Mike's second point of the game, and now Finn now leads seven points to five. Uh, Finn's first substitute of the game, and it's Colin O'Gorman is going off. He's been replaced by 21 Daniel Cunningham. Short kick out. Upper touch now. Touch now down the halfway line. Still was. TJ Butler. And to see what happened in the back. Yes. And it's another free into that. Upper judge. And referee is calling. Daryl Boyle now has been spoken to Daryl who was black carded in the, the last game. He's getting a yellow gate, yellow card this time. You need this round down your hand uh, opportunities to Paul Shannon who has already got four four points. Lining up this one. Kick, kick. He doesn't miss him, he doesn't miss him, but he has to <laughs> missing this one. So it remains. Now Finn seven points. Upper church five points. Ten minutes into the second half. Long way to go, yes. to kick out. It's about this way out towards Captain Stephen now and Stephen. Yeah. Uh, again upper touch now getting the brakes. And oh what a run come out Carl. <laughs> 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 
And the upper church uh, lads are saying that Fahal never went for the ball and looking from this <laughs> my view he didn't do it but we got <laughs> we got away with it. He took out the man, which is the main thing. The result of no score for upper church. Good man Cahill. Yeah. Kick out this time. Down the middle towards Jerry Jerry Cohen does three. How are there so many upper church lads? And now towards Paul Shannon. Paul being pressurized by Sean Nagel. Keep him out in the corner flag. And he's gone around Sean. He's dropping it in. He's dropping it in. And five by six is gone over the hour. That's a one point game. Upper touch from Ban, six points. Arkinen, seven points. Again, it's the kick outs. Um, they seem to be winning every kick out, Upper Church. All right. Caught with this kick out. Get down the middle again. Yep. Need I say it? Win, it, win the breaks again. And set up another attack. See now this is, could be dangerous if Shannon gets it in his hands. Well, John Brock by Sean Nagel. Oh. Try to break and loose. Break and loose. And that's it, Mike Tobin has it now. Loses. Oh, Jesus. That's the equaliser for Upper Trust from Ben. And again, it came from a sloppy player for him. Very sloppy player. Seven points apiece. Touch now, I haven't done a little pop for pass, and it's cut down the middle now by. Oh. Have a touch now. He's walking in, he's gone a long way. Been tracked by, tracked by Smiley. Okay, and cover touch. No surprise there if this happened. I just. Frustrating to watch because. Petty freeze they're giving away like. Now they're gonna find themselves point behind. <laughs> it's now upper touch from Ben, eight points, Arfin and seven points. Arfin now uh, well, like they're gonna have to try and box up on kick outs because upper touch from Ben, I win every kick out. Oh Jesus. Poor kick out by Cahill Boyle. They're setting up another one, but well won back by Gavin Whelan. Gavin gives it on now to Dara. Dara gives it on now to Aero. Aero. Now Finn, they're just making, uh, setting up now. Oh, well, well, important interception there by Gavin Whelan. Robert Condon comes away with it. Is it on to Mike Torben? And to Shots. Shots has it. He's out to travel in a long way now. Ah, he's out to lose him. So this is absolute crazy play. Absolute ridiculous. But Arfin, a line ball to Arfin. What do we, do we think we're world beaters that we can take on the whole lot of them on our own? We'll have to drive it in now by shocks. He drives it in now towards Mike Hogan. Mike Hogan, win well now. He's gone around his man. He's getting it on now. Great run by Dara Boyle. Dara Boyle hops it. Gives it back to Mike Barlow. Mike Barlow kicks it over the bar. That's better. Well done, lads. When you leave the ball in, you will get the scores. It's Michael's third point of the game. And we're back at level again. At the moment, there's still no separating these teams. Eight points apiece. It's a mighty effort by these young lads. And then kick out now. Nero has it. But they seem to win every break. It's just. And then now Stephen Lambert has it. 
And a good ball on towards Mike Mike Barlow. He's a long way out from goals. He's been smothered by three lads. Gives it on out to Jerry. And it's a free into Alfin and right on the 45 yard line. Leave it down. Jerry's out there getting a this stage you'd have to compliment both teams because this we said uh, hour and a half in, in the drawing game and now it's so far in this game as well they really are giving it everything and there's no still no separating the teams as Jerry Conan kicks it out in towards zero but too easy that's Another attack from upper touch. Right now it's going out. It's line ball tapping and well read by Robert Condon. Gives it on to Smiley. Smiley gives it on to Shocks. Gives it back to Smiley. And gives it on now to Daniel Cunningham. Daniel now has it. Gives a good ball in towards Mike, Mike Hogan. Mike Hogan on to Mike Barlow now. Mike is side to side stepping. Gives it out now to... Just seem to be ma making things so hard for ourselves. When does but scores at a premium. When you get in here, have a shot. But they're trying to walk it in. That's on, the church, you know, on the attack again and it's given in uh, now towards Shannon and Shocks has it lost it. Gives it on Sean Nagel. Onto Gavin Wheel and Gavin is turning back in. Onto Gavin, Jerry Cronin. Onto Aero. Uh, everyone's uh, everyone's standing up now. They're saying, "Come on, Aero!" They are thinking about and gives delicate little chip in towards Mike Hogan. Mike wins it. Mike has the winnings. Gives it out to Mike Bell and now, near enough. That's around my point. When you're near enough, have a go, and that's it. Scores at a premium here. Michael Bell gets his fourth point and Alfinan's nine points to go back in the lead. Nine points to eight. Instead of trying to walk it in, when you get into the scoreable position, hit it over the bar, lads. So Alfinan back in the lead now. High ball out towards Daniel Cole. And got the losing it now to TJ Ryan. TJ Ryan. And down the wing. Is it on now to 15? Neil Grant, Neil Grant kicks it, and that's a good score. Got the back level, surprise, surprise, they're level again. Now, Finn and nine points, up just on Ben, nine points. I yeah, just checked that, how the time is going. So 20 minutes gone, there are 10 minutes left in this game. How are we going to guess another? Out of extra time. Well, at the moment, you'd have to say so because there's, there's really nothing between these teams. Anyway, now the goalkeeper, our referee's gone in talking to the umpires. He's only asking um, there's a second game on here and uh, one of the teams are both teams are actually trying to warm up behind uh, the play which is a bit unfair on the lads out on the pitch. Very, they're actually very close to the end line and rightly so the referee is telling them move away. Ball down. Ball is there's the ball, yeah. It's back at the other end there with in defense. Carl Boyle has it. Carl bit of kick out. He's like hands on the back there, but Offer just still have it. Give me out to death gentleman, Paul Shannon. And his left leg is gone round by 
Pin it, Stephen Lambert with him. Stay with him, Stephen on his left leg. Well, got in the block. Keep it in, Cahill. Classic. Because they're going to be 45. Give it out now to Leo to Stephen Lambert. Stephen on to Daniel Cunningham. Daniel looking at his options. On to Shocks. Shocks switches play now. It's going out to Robert Condon. Out to Dara Boyle. Dara gives us a good one through the middle by Daniel Cunningham. Gives it on to Robert. And Robert is going around his man. And no surprise he tried to take on three men. And it smothered. Perhaps. With so little time left, why will you leave the ball in? Robert Tush now on the attack, they're driving forward. See, they'll leave the ball in. It's in towards that danger man, Paul Shannon. He releases it this time to Dara Brennan. And been pressurized by Sean Nagel. Back out to TJ Bourne and he's dropping. And it's gone wide. You see, tiredness is creeping in on both sides. Legs are getting tired. Oh, with the kick out. And now this one towards Gavin Ray and Gavin Raw well held. That's one of the very few kick outs up in the one. But we've lost it, have we? No, Dara has it. Gavin has it. Shocks. Gives it on now. Daniel Cullion. Daniel, leave it in, Daniel. To Jerry Crone. There's too many there, lads. Jerry's gone round three. Leave it in! And just on to Captain Jerry Co Stephen Lambert gives it out now to Mike Hogan. He's given Mike a lot of work to do. And he's kept it in. He's done very well there. And on to Mike Bearline. Back on to Mike Hogan. Long way out and he's kicking it. He's kicking it in towards. Out now, kicks it out now. Out towards it's gone all the way to Paul Shannon, and he gives it on to Peter Button. This is to Jack Oldman, no, but he's a plenty of room in front of him. Tara Bile is with him, he pushes Badara, and it's, it's well done. Call, call, it could have been, oh, it's probably Call. Reacted well, yeah. <laughs> and need I say it's been our friend in possession to give away a needless free. <laughs> Twenty five minutes gone in this game. And three into suits. That man again, Paul Shannon. He's already scored five points from play. Corland to Corland to Gun Wild. Corland Wild. The next goal could be vital, that. Absolutely vital. A few minutes left to play. It's now still nine points apiece. Cahill Boyle. Get a good kick out now, Cahill. Out towards Dara Hazard. Dara's going around his man. Is it on Tara? And I hope they just don't do any messing with this. Uh, and just as I say it, what do they try and do? They're trying to. But they're lucky they got a free out, and maybe this time they might kick it in. Aero. Kick it forward! Ah, lads, 
this is just, yeah. Shocks now has it. Shocks gives it on now towards Smiley. Smiley, great break now, Sean Nagel. Sean has gone in 45 yards out. Gives it out to Mike Bell. It is a chance. It's a chance. Oh, geez. And just we lost, we lost a bit of it. And it's back on now. And then uh, upper touch to Ben. Got a great score there to go one point ahead. It's on now towards Michael Barlow. I think need to get something here. Michael Barlow. Yep, he's fouled. Foul now. I guess up. Good. Score now. Upper touch to Ben. Ten points. Arfin and nine points. This is about one minute of normal time to play. Colin, go in front of the keeper. But he knows it's for Michael. This is a very important pressurized kick. Michael drops it. I'm wide. 